Morning. First, our main story. The Queen will become the longest reigning monarch in British history today, passing the record set by her great-great-grandmother, Queen Victoria. Yes, the Queen became monarch on February the 6th, 1952, when her father, George VI, died. Her coronation the following year was watched by millions of people around the world. David Cameron has already paid tribute, saying that she has a remarkable record and is a symbol of Britain's enduring spirit. Today, business in the House of Commons will be postponed for half an hour so MPs can pay their own tributes. And to mark the occasion, an official picture has been released showing the Queen at work at her desk. It was taken by the British photographer, Mary McCartney. Her Majesty has insisted that it is business as usual today. Together with the Duke of Edinburgh, she'll open the new Scottish Borders Railway. And our Scotland correspondent Lorna Gordon joins us uh, now from Edinburgh. So uh, just the normal working day for Her Majesty. Morning, Lorna. Yes, good morning, Bill. You know, the Queen is usually in Scotland at this time of year, but she's usually on her holidays up on Royal Deeside at her private residence, Balmoral. Today, though, uh, she's breaking that holiday for, as you say, a business as usual, official engagements, opening the new Borders Railway. This is uh, the longest uh, track of railway to be opened in Britain for a 100 years, a 30-mile route which goes from here in Edinburgh down to the borders. Thousands of people are expected to uh, welcome her along that route as she celebrates becoming Britain's longest reigning monarch. Yeah, and uh, several events taking place uh, around Britain, of course, and especially in the capital, London. But uh, presumably she'll take a moment of some sort to have a little celebration. You'd have thought so, but I think if she does, it's going to be in private. Uh, but as you say, plenty of people will publicly want to celebrate this historic milestone. There'll be a, a flotilla of boats heading down the Thames in the middle, of the middle of the day. MPs are going to postpone business for half an hour so that they can pay tribute to the head of state. Uh, there will be photographic exhibitions of the Queen on display at the Palace of Holyrood house here in Edinburgh as well as at Buckingham Palace and here in Edinburgh this evening there will be fireworks over her now retired yacht the Royal Yacht Britannia and so plenty happening even if the Queen says today is just business as usual. Lorna thanks very much Lorna Gordon in Edinburgh. And we'll have more on that throughout the programme here on Breakfast this morning. In other news details of a plan to relocate 160,000 refugees across 22 EU countries will be set out this morning. The President of the European Commission, Jean-Claude Juncker, will outline a new strategy to deal with the large influx of migrants, although Britain will not be included in the process. Our Europe correspondent Chris Morris reports from Strasbourg. 